thanks for joining us. Um, we are out here on one of our regular beaches. It's a little overcast, a little bit chilly today. Um, they said we might get some rain, but you know, that ain't gonna stop us. We got waterproof clothes, so we're good to go. Um, anyway, we got Larry right there. We've got Jim out in the water right there. Um, my first little target here is a little shell casing, a little 22, I think. I don't really know. I don't know guns at all. So anyway, um, all right, well, we're gonna get to hunting here and we will let you know what we find. Girls, treasure hunters. I'm out in the water. Yeah, it's uh, 62 degrees outside, raining. Uh, low tides at one o'clock. I don't know if you can see them, but I got Gina and Larry on the beach. I'm wearing a five mil wetsuit, so I'm out here and seeing if I can find anything. And so far, I haven't got any hits at all. Um, yeah. It's actually the bottom feels like it's kind of sanded up so um but we're gonna keep trying and uh see what we can come up with so water feels like it's about 60 degrees it's kind of cold out here even with the wetsuit on but um i'll warm up here still better than being out here in just my shorts but gotta be in the water anyways all right i'll touch base with you when i find something i got my first signal for today um, looks like it's a quarter. I'll take it. Good start. Just a regular new quarter, but hey, it's a quarter. So, all right, it's in my bag. Break the hunting. So, got a good signal here. A little scattered, but that's what we got. I'm using the T Rex with the 3 8 hole, so. Not a lot of stuff can get through it. Check around. All right, it's in the scoop. Ha! It's a nickel. Good. It's pretty deep. Anyways, all right, it's just a regular nickel. Can't see the date on it, so. All right, so two quarters, two nickels, but I've got another signal right over here. In the scoop, as it fell out, let me check around. Oh, in the scoop. Ah, it's a bottle cap. Yeah, it's a hiney can. Anyways. All right, there are a couple signals out here, not a lot. I mean, like I said, it's they're really, really, really deep, and I've got this Excalibur 800 maxed out right now, so well, I'm not picking it up. It's deeper than my coil can go, so but that nickel is pretty deep. Well, hopefully, we can get on some gold, but I think that gold is going to be. I don't know, two quarters and a nickel. Seems to be the, I mean, I'm where the heavy stuff is, so we'll see what happens. All right. Okay, so there's not a lot of fine day. It's probably gonna be a bleak day, so I have to entertain myself somehow. So what I'm up to is I have this full pack of crackers um, and they are not for my snacks. And then we have these lovely birds right here. So I'm very slowly gathering the birds. See how that works? And then as I get them closer, when next time Larry bends down to dig a, a hole, <laughs> I'm gonna throw crackers <laughs> at him and see what happens. He may not think I'm funny, but you know, I probably find it really hilarious. So anyway, all right, well, I'm gonna go back to hunting real slow. Uh, anyway, I'll let you know how it goes. Got a decent little high tone here. Um, some rings come in like that too, but it might be a dime or a penny. So. Uh, detector says it's out of the water. 
Yep, it's a penny. All right. It's a regular rotten penny. Okay. Check your holes because I just got another signal in there. Might be another penny. Getting a little coin still. All right. Let's see what we got. Ah, another penny. Another penny. All right. And I still got more sounds in that hole there. Backfill on me. Hmm. Yep, there it is. Another penny. All right. Oh, well. All right, so this would be number four if this is a penny. I'm about, I'm out about eh, almost up to my knees. Oh, got it. First scoop. Got another penny. Pretty trash. All right, moving on. I've dug a lot of trash and a lot of foil today, but I finally got a signal that was not garbage. Uh, it's right there. You can see it, maybe. Just a penny. So, it's just a modern penny. Nothing crazy, nothing special. So, but like I said, that's the first target. Um, I think my shenanigans about Larry is not going to pay off today. So, he moved way on down there. So, whatever. Doesn't he know he's messing up my plans? So, all right, well, I'm going to get back to hunting. We may have to save these shenanigans for another day. Oh, I got a really good tone here. And I'm three scoops into it, so let's see what we got. I got some more friction rings for my coil and my shaft. It's, the thing seems to be loose enough. Either that or I snapped the bolt on it. In the coil. Oh, I'm sorry, in the scoop. Oh, it feels heavy. Maybe a sinker. Oh, well, that's weird looking. What is that? It's got stars all the way around it. No ridges on the outside. That's a weird looking coin. Um, no cash value. Okay, it's a token. It's a pretty cool looking token now. Alright. Pretty cool. No cash value. I don't know if you can see it, but there's an eagle. Anyways, stars. It's pretty cool at first glance, but yeah, there seems to be a token. I like tokens, so yeah, it's a keeper. Alright. Another target. That's great. Um, it's just a nickel, but that's cool. I'll take it. Alrighty. Very cool. I have quite a little gathering of birds. Now I just need Larry to come over here and dig a target. <laughs> Scratch it down and I dig up this little earring. Actually, you know what? That looks like a toe ring. That's a really big toe ring. See, it's rounded on both sides. Well, maybe not. It could be an earring. I'm going to say got junk in it but kind of cool stars all the way around it my first piece of jewelry today so but i'm sure it's not real of anything because of the signal i got so anyways all right in my bag thought i had a ring maybe next time i think i'm in a really good spot and we do have some birds here not a lot but larry is right there so. Can get this cracker to work. Come on, guys, do it. Ready? Come on, guys. Oh, here they come. Hold on. <laughs> Come 
He totally busted me, I think. Three crackers left. I don't know if he knows it's me or not. I don't know. Alright, ready? <gasps> Dang it. movie going on. Great, huh? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, we got some pretty creepy looking birds here. <laughs> oh. Okay, yes, yeah, so he doesn't know it's me yet. That's great. I'm totally gonna have to edit this. It's running way too long. Alright, devious. She's got a cracker and Larry's over there, but all these seagulls are here, so she's gonna throw that cracker over by Larry and see if the seagulls all go around him. <laughs> he just ignored him. <laughs> Anyways, I don't know if you guys can see all the way out there, but that looks like a old pirate ship. Oh my god, it's beautiful. It looks so real. I'd love to see that thing up close. That is so pretty. Anyways. Oh, 
digging myself up. Away. There's Gina over there in the blue jacket. Larry. Got quite a hole going there. You just found a watch. It works. We'll have to check it out in a little while. Alright. Anyways. Check this out. Looks like an old spoon ring. Possibly silver. Looks like it's made out of a spoon. Pretty cool. It's really super dirty, but it looks old. Real old. Anyways. Yeah, we'll have to clean this one up and see what it is. It definitely looks like a spoon ring, so. But, ring in the scoop, ring on the hook. Nice. Look at that. Yeah. Spoon ring. Hopefully it's silver. Rang up nice, but we'll see. Alright, let me put it on my hook. Cool. It's heavy too, real heavy. Uh, seems to be a like a clay layer here. So I'm gonna keep searching this little area I found here. Got a nickel and then I got that ring. So Let's see what I can find. All right. I have like half of a cracker left, um, but I did find half of a dead fish, which I'm actually allergic to. Um, but I'm gonna carry it around anyway <laughs> until I get closer and I can throw it. Because these birds are totally stalking me. They know I have it. So, alright, we're going to mosey on over this way. What'd you find? Oh, look at that! Larry found a watch! Nice! That's pretty awesome. Watch. Throw it in a hole for you? No, no, it's all good. I was just kind of meandering anyway. That's pretty cool though. Still works. Right. <clears throat> I'll just work in the water line. Right? Yeah. I was kind of meandering back and forth. There might be a bunch of stuff right here. Right? bottom fish and that's just pirating right there. You could hear this but that's got a crazy low tone to it so I'm gonna dig it. Be a piece of aluminum foil or something but I haven't heard that low tone in a while, so let's see what we got. Yeah, it's still a good low tone. Not a oops. Slipped on a rock. Almost fell in. It's a little cold out here. It's supposed to be cold tomorrow. I see gold. I see gold, guys. I see gold. 14 carat. Oh my god, look at that. Oh my god. Yes, look at that. Stamped 14k right there. I don't know if you can see it. That's 14k. Look at that. This was a nice low tone, too. That is pretty. Look at 
looks like it just might have fallen off. So it looks like it works. Look at that. Woohoo! Yeah! 14K. I love it. I hope that's not plated. I can't see it, but it looks real to me. Oh, it says 14K on it, so. Alright, I gotta go show them now, so I'll be right back. Look at what I got. That's something gold in here. Oh. That's kind of weird. It's got like an angel on it or something. I don't see any markings. It came out really staticky, so. Yeah, I'm looking at it. It's played it, but kind of cool, man. That's kind of cool. I don't know what it is, but. It's a cherub? Cherub? I don't know. Really light though. Super light, but it's kind of cool. Alright. First time I ever found one like that. That's kind of cool. Alright. In my bag it goes. I took to my wife and I just dug this out. I don't know. It's a ring. Definitely a ring. It's got something on it. I don't know what it says, but I have to check it out. I don't know. Another ring. What's it say on it? I have no clue. Pretty heavy though. Anyways, that's pretty deep. You can see the big of the hole and how many scoops I got out of it, but it's a ring. Alright, that on my hook. Try to catch up to my wife, so I think we're gonna call it a day. I don't know where she's at, but Oh, I think I see her way over there. Anyways, bye. There was the beep of the camera, so expect the kitties here anytime now. <laughs> yep. mm -hmm. It's true. Anyways, uh, so this is actually our... Anyways, hi, people. How you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, this was our Saturday hunt, and uh, true. I was pretty much in my wetsuit in the water, and Gina was on the dry sand and a little bit of the wet sand, so yes. uh, we went to one of our favorite beaches, and... Uh, um, I did pretty good. Um, I'll explain why here in a couple minutes, but let's take a look at what Gina found first. Um, not a lot. Okay. Just a little baby bit of clad. Right. That was Six pennies and two yeah, nickels. Yeah, a Anything nickels old? and a little bullet casing, whatever. That's it. No, nothing old. That's it. Okay. Well, Clearly. I mean, it was, it was raining and storming on us, and the winds were up a little bit, so. Yeah. Um, the water wasn't really that bad, though. Um, no. There were some waves, but not a lot. It wasn't really too rough that I couldn't get out there. So. Right. I'm Anyways. I was actually um, planning more cracker revenge than hunting. Right, right, right. You know. <laughs> yeah. I did a lot of garbage, though, too. I did. So. I did. I did. Yeah. Again, once again, we don't display our garbage. I mean, yeah. You can I see mean, that on yeah. any video. But we yeah. all know what bottle caps and pull yeah. tabs look we're, like. We're all about the treasure. So. Yes. Although this isn't treasure, but... It's not. Something but interesting, I was, guess. Yeah. It's 22 cartridge. It was pretty deep. So, mm -hmm. yeah, I had to work nice. for that. <laughs> All right. Well. Okay. Uh, take a look at uh, what I got here. Um, first off, I got some gray matter. I don't know what this is. It's flat and it's uh, um, lead. and almost looked like a bell seal um, the way it was made. But, anyways, who knows? Doesn't have anything on it, so. It's a thing. Um, a junk earring. Huh. Yep. You can get tetanus if you wear that sucker. Yeah. <laughs> yeah it's a little rusted up. So. Yeah. Thought it was a giant toe ring at first because it was round on the back side. Oh, there's yes. one. Jeez. Oh, um, two little lead ball. Hey. Oh my God. Here, come over here, Toby. Wow. Come here. I will pet you, buddy. Um, you I found this, and this was a heart stopper because I was about right. Eh, right below my camera in the water and. I saw this shiny gold stuff, but um, if you look at the back, it's it's just plated it's plastium. stuff. Like, you know, it's not plastium, it's metal. Is it? Oh, okay. Know, that's how my I bad. detected it in the water. Oh, duh. My yeah. bad. But you can see a little where the cherub or whatever it is. Yeah. That's on there. Um, angel or whatever it is that's yeah. stuck on it's there. It's cherub. But I mean, that's, you know, 
finding out in the scoop, I mean, the first glance, it's like, oh my God, it's Truck It Rich. But anyways, mm -hmm. not really. No. Anyways, uh, I did find this interesting spoon ring. It's pretty cool. Um, spoon rings are a symbol of love. That's what they, actually back in the old days, uh, in the um, slavery days, they used to steal these from the owner or the, uh, or the, the, the landowner or whatever it is, owner. plantation uh -huh. owner. And, um, make wedding rings out of them and that's what they use for wedding rings but to this day a spoon ring actually means love and Aww. and that's what it means so uh this one's actually plated i thought it was uh stainless steel i'm not stainless sterling steel but silver. sterling silver um at first but after cleaning it up you can see the plating coming on mm -hmm. and it is an rs brothers which was i believe they were back in the 1800s is when mm -hmm. they started making them but it's really pretty it's well made um, unfortunately, it's plated it and it is not. Yeah. Cat, go away. Anyways. Yes. So that's what we got for that one. That's and true. I did find a 925 Harley Davidson ring. That's, that's pretty, pretty cool. cool. That's a big it's one, too. Big. I mean, that's huge. Yeah. But um, this was a purplish black when I got it and I cleaned it up a little bit. It does say Harley Davidson on it. Um, I don't know if you could see it or not. The lighting's not that great. But um, it weighs about 10 grams. I think it was 10.3 grams. So it's got a little bit of weight to it, but nice 925 silver ring. Yep. And then, well, let's go to the clash. Oh, um, such a tease. <laughs> I know, huh? I got yeah. some uh, quarters, uh, two nickels, a um, couple dimes, um, some pennies. Oh, this one's an actual old penny. Um, it's really thin. Um, I cannot see what it is, but I'm thinking it might be a weedy. But anyways, that's my old coin. And then this, actually, if you see it, it's got an eagle on it and a star. So that's the side I saw first. And I thought, oh, my God, I found an old, old coin. Then you turn around, it says, no cash value. Dang so, anyways, it. that's Bye, another heart stopper. Put that one with that one, and, and those are both, you know, nitros. So, it was a anyways, day. no cash value. No. I don't know what token it goes to, but it's definitely a token. I like the eagle with the stars. That's pretty cool. It is cool. And then for my big find. <laughs> Toby did it. Toby. <laughs> where Toby is did it? it? I don't know anyways, where it could be. Let's watch. Ta da! <laughs> this bad boy right here. Now, I was chest deep in the water when this came out. Um, it's a beautiful so bracelet, pretty. absolutely beautiful bracelet. It's not broken, so it came nope. unlatched is what had happened. Um, it is 14K. Um, it weighs about 16.9 grams. Very pretty. And, yes. and it retails, we looked it up, um, yes. the smaller one on 11 grams retails for $2,100. Yes. So, so one um, heck of this a one is actually it. almost 17 grams so we're thinking this was probably retails for about twenty twenty four hundred dollars um, it's beautiful it's not broken at all it needs to be cleaned up I haven't cleaned it up at all but I don't know if you could see it right here it does say 14k and it does say uh, a maker's mark on it too so it's really pretty um, but anyways that's my big find yeah um, and, and this was, was really like I said deep. this was ch chest deep in the water and uh, it was towards the end of the day when I found it. So um, I found this actually before I found the silver ring. Um, actually, before I found the, the spoon ring, and then I found this when I was going looking for you oh, on where oh, it headed out. Oh, good thing um, you were looking for me. Yeah, then. and this thing was so nasty looking. I thought it was just a piece of you know nonsense bling or something. And then we get home and find out it's got nine two five in it. So, anyways, so yeah, that was a huge day for me. Um, mm -hmm. Gold and silver in a scoop and uh, a couple uh, oddities that uh, would make you think you had some more silver and gold. But anyways, yep. so, all right, well, um, what are you doing? We have a shout out. Oh, okay, shout yes. out, yes. shout out. Um, I don't know, I think everybody wants to just stare at that gold. It's okay. Okay. Yeah, they can stare ahead. at my silver. Um, we won um, a giveaway. Oh, over, we did. Yes, right. from Brad over at Tazzy Adventures, and uh -huh. we actually won um, this little one so ounce. That is so pretty. That, that is, is one gorgeous. ounce. Gorgeous. That is a one ounce Australian $1, bar. Yeah. One dollar. Very, one dollar very bar. pretty. It's kind of heavy. It's kind of cool. Yes. Silver. That's pretty so nice. We won yeah, that. Yeah, definitely. 
And then we also won this 1888 shilling. Right. It's very cool. Yeah, that's like, pretty cool. Yeah. Actually, this is a metal detector flame right here. Yes, yes, so it was. He actually found that. I've never seen that. a shilling before, and that's pretty Me cool. Me either. That's really cool. Yeah, 1888 shilling. Coins. That's pretty cool. Yeah. yeah. So. We found it in the video. Tiger in snakes Hickory? everywhere. Yes. We'll have to look up tiger we'll snakes. We'll have to go watch that video. I'm sure they sound pretty dangerous. And then he also just sent us a couple of other things that we didn't win. He just huh. wanted to send them. So okay. there's this Australian punny. Right. So it's got let's the go. Sorry, little kangaroo. Well, I don't, think, <laughs> I don't know if they call them kangaroos there, but we call them kangaroos. Um, yeah, I don't know if you could see it with the plastic and stuff, but it's pretty cool. Yeah, that's pretty cool. It is pretty yep. cool. And then this um, half penny, which is I don't know again if you can see that real well or not, but right. but that is a half penny. That's pretty cool. It is, and it's got the kangaroo on the back too, so that's pretty cool. Yeah. Um, that is cool. What year was this? 1956, I think. Maybe. 50, 1950. Yeah, that's really pretty. And then this one, so I'm not really sure what it is. Um, it's my bad. I can't read that. No, I don't know either. I don't have my glasses on, so I can't read it. But, yeah. I'm not sure. Maybe Taz can comment on what that right? is. Right? Yeah. I like the little d guy on the back, though. He looks like one of those little dinosaurs off of Jurassic Park. Hmm. <laughs> Interesting. There's a little. Anyway, and then this is, I'm assuming, a, a penny. Looks like a little honey badger or something know, on there. I don't know. dime is our smallest coin. It could be. Well, it says one, so mm -hmm. I would assume it's one right. cent. Don't know. Um, and then this is also Pretty very, cool. very cool. This one is a 1918 sixpence. 1918 sixpence? Yeah, yeah. It's really cool. So, yes, this was very cool. Um, and again, this was from um, Brad over at Tazzy Adventures. Um, yeah, he's got and if a you really guys, good yeah, he like his family's involved, and they just have a good old time. So definitely, definitely go check him out. Um, yeah, and a lot of these, actually, I think almost all of them, except for this, is um, detector finds. Yeah. So, so um, it's just really cool. So yeah, these are great. He was very generous to send them. these over to us. Um, yes. And uh, that was pretty cool. I think this was in the giveaway. Yes, was this, this, in this the, and this the was shilling. in the giveaway. Okay, yes. those were the giveaways. And these and were just little and these are just extra, little extra things, things that he, he sent to us. We would appreciate, yeah, which definitely. we definitely and do. We definitely do. It's beautiful. Those are all great Actually, I think finds. We put it all in one frame. I know, right? Small frame, so. It is really pretty. Anyways, uh, so yes, okay. um, that's about it for Saturday's wrap up. Um, mm -hmm. uh, it was a cold day but a very successful day for me so yes. um yes and uh it hopefully next fun. time the background will be pink instead of teal but we'll see we'll see so all right so, until our next wrap up have a good one and talk to you later subscribe um share and uh make sure you uh hit that notification uh so we can let you know when our Next Sunday video. Yes, uh, yep. yes. And, and we'll put a, or a link to Tazzy Adventures down in the description. So go ahead and check on that and um, watch one of his videos. Give him a like and a subscribe. And like I said, they're yeah. just fun people. So. All right. Have a good one. Say bye, Toby. Bye, Toby. Bye, Toby. <laughs> bye, Toby. <laughs> Brat.